Hey everyone, it's Char from Char's Fashion Nation. <laughs> I'm trying to think, where did I put, did, did I put that back over there? I'm hoping I didn't accidentally throw away the wrong one of these. Whoops, I think I might have by accident. I, I was looking for my elf, this the old one. Whoops. I keep a wastebasket under here that, like, nothing goes in. It, you know, no liquid, no food. It's just, like, from sewing. Whoops. <laughs> now that we found that. Um, so, what am I up to today? Well, later tonight, I will be on Freaky Friday with Makeup Addict 1992. Type that all in one long thing. To find her because if you don't a lot of other stuff comes up now i do like how elf secures this on the back now this particular one because they didn't have any over at the right aid and that's usually where i get it from um it's like they don't have my shade and during this time of the year i'm the uh toffee yeah toffee it looks darker in the bottle, trust me. Um, so, gonna open her up. So, today I need to go for a blood draw, run my errands, yada yada. Um, there we go. Yay. And as always, this is what I start off with, just so you guys know. And I'm not going to make this a super long video because I have shit to do today. <laughs> I know later today I've got to clean my brushes again. I clean them. I have this lovely, if you haven't seen that video of me using that brush cleaner from Amazon. That thing is nice. Maybe I'll have to do another video and we'll see how like um how it works out now the other thing i found my anastasia brush i was like so worried i was like looking through stuff and you know how our intuition is like we look and then and then it shows up when we're not looking for it <laughs> or you say you Sometimes this works too. If you can't find something to save for the love of everything, put it back so I can find it where I put it. And then, ta-da, it puts it near there. <laughs> Whatever it is, it puts it near there. So this is how I start off. A lot of people know this, although I did almost block my brows. I guess that would work as a brow blocker. Um... If you're doing some sort of look to do that, another sip of my Death Wish Coffee Espresso. Death Wish Coffee, the best coffee that is ever made. Trust me, once you try Death Wish, there is no other. That was a shameless plug <laughs> for my favorite coffee in the world. So, I'm actually just going to do a light look today. You can tell the difference. Like, a lot of people are like, oh, you really aren't that tan. Are you serious? And this is just with using the regular light. Um, I think with this on my eyes, you can tell. There's a tan there. I'm still in my winter tan. <laughs> um, so, like I said, we're going to just do a basic look. Maybe with a different brush. That one has a lot of dark on it. Um, you know what I haven't done? I haven't used this one here yet. And I think it's called Rumors. There's a lot of rumors going around the internet lately. Like, holy crap. Can people just, like, stop the bullshit already? Let's say if I ever decided to do a drag look, which maybe I will on purpose, would people come at me for that for being an actual woman? And why, why are people 
just into like such bullshit lately. Anyway, next I think, because like I said, I kind of want a basic look. This is just light, light. I do like it. It's buildable. Um, we're going to go with our basics today because this kind of has that as an undertone base. You know, I actually don't mind showing the full thing of how I do my makeup. I think it's great because now I can just pick up a fluffy br blendy brush. So, if anybody ever wanted an update for endochronology, I have to go back to them this month. And, um, yeah, I have to go back to them this month. So, I think maybe the next two I will dip into will be Confession and Canceled. A Canceled Confession. There you go. Canceled Confession. That's funny. So, we want to go into Confession And if you accidentally do what I just did, blend it out with your finger. Because it works. And the other reason that, like, I've just started doing my makeup a little different. Oh, and if you haven't seen my video where I met up with... One of my lovely friends that we've been friends for like four years, three or four years now. And I met up finally face to face because, you know, like a lot of us creators, we're friends. But a lot of us don't get to meet face to face. But when we get the chance to do that, it's so fun. So I'm just going to take this little brush here, which I barely use. I don't know why. And just do that. And you see what I do? I go like this. I don't scrub my brush into it. It's not a scrub brush. It's a makeup brush. <laughs> Let's go back in there. I don't think I picked up enough for this side. And then blendy, blendy, blend away. I said simple look. You know how this goes. We always say simple and then it ends up not being so simple. That's simple, isn't it? <laughs> and now I'm probably like, I found my Anastasia Beverly Hills brush for my eyebrows because it's got the spoolie on one end. I think I'm like Anne. I like to have the spoolie a certain way. You know why? Because if you think about it, when you're doing this, it makes it a lot easier because you can bend it back. Just don't bend it too hard. See how much easier that was? And then bend it back. And you can put the little cover back over it if you want. I think that's the way to keep it cleaner and then you got the little brush right here now mind you I have the Anastasia Beverly Hills brow balm and then I have the creme shop holy brow these I won from and I leave her down below I won these from Mary Catherine loves cats she's a sweetheart please go check her out um, she's a wonderful person. I go over there because I like her. She's a lovely person. She's very calm. You know how we calm gals are. We're calm until somebody pisses us off. <laughs> right? We're calm until you piss us off. I 
and just go like that. And you see how that is with my natural hairs. Then you can just take that and go like that and just stroke that on there and it looks like brow hair. I know. I feel like my brows are going away from this part of my face. I know that in May I have to go back for another round of Botox for my headaches and such. Um, which I also have to do a slight change up in my diet. See, so it happens if you like smeared across versus doing the strokes. I want to show you that. We'll fix it. I have to try to make that match because I'll take the spoolie. Now, that's the other thing about the spoolie on this is you can take that when you do that and rake that through. It's not like reiki. <laughs> If you meditate like I do, I meditate before I go to bed and I meditate when I get up. Sometimes meditation is better than medication. <laughs> now remember, I have not put my foundation on yet. So I'm going to do that and... Um, I'm going to use up what I can out of the Juvia's Place. Now, I've been using this as a, a concealer, and I'm almost out. I got whatever's left in the stick. And since it's down like that, I can take a small brush like this. Just take a small brush like that, and you can see how that worked. I don't know if you can see how that worked. You can do that. Or you can make a mess of your hands and, and do that. Now, this is actually a foundation stick. Um, mm -hmm. So, anyway, I'm going to finish this up and then we will be right back. One thing I do want to show you before not this. I will be using this though. This is the Fenty Beauty. Um, you probably realize that by the packaging, right? And um, it's gorgeous. I do use this like anytime I do a makeup look. The Gerard Cosmetics uh, Pink Blurring Powder. I love this because I have it over here, but I don't have it over here. You can tell the huge difference. I use a little compact light. Why not? You know, that's what ladies used to do back in the day. And if you feel, I don't feel like this is just for under the eye. Like if you feel that there's a spot on your face that might need a little bit of blur, use it because sometimes I feel like there's little spots on my face. I'll show you what I have been using it for because like right here I have been doing this and that way when I finish up my makeup that's sitting there or I can just go ahead and take my dampen beauty blender of course another Gerard Cosmetics and I got this from the Five Below. I got to get another one soon. So I should have got a bunch of these. So all I do is take my Dampen Beauty Blender and press that in. And it helps to lighten up around there. And just, you can do the same thing here if you want. But do you see how that just like that? changed the look of the eye like really good so I did want to show you that I love this I love the little pup that comes with it oh, I got a hair in my eye 
<laughs> well, um, but anyway, I love the little pup that comes with it. Um, I did watch another channel, which I'll leave below, I believe. I always want to say Yari, but it's not Yari. <laughs> anyway, she was showing how she leaves hers upside down. So she doesn't have to worry about, you know, like opening it up. And you saw that like a little bit went. And then when you put it this back the other way, you have powder everywhere. Which is true, but so I always leave this with that. But I did want to show you that. Now, um, I have the Dragon Beauty lip color. Now, if I really want, I'll just pop this in my hip bag. I don't wear a purse. I wear a hip bag. <sighs> that way, things are more secure. So, and then I have the Believe Cosmetics from the Dollar General. Yes. Oh, by the way, how's the brows look? I use this too. <laughs> so, I will put on this mascara. I will say that this is really good. It's not... It's not shocking, but it is a good mascara, and for $5, yeah, for $5, you can't beat that. Mascara is too freaking expensive anymore, so anyway, I'll be back. So, my last thing before I get dressed, <laughs> I'm already partially dressed, I just need to finish getting dressed, so the... Gerard Cosmetics Lay All Day Setting Spray in a Dreamsicle. This is my favorite. I know I'm not the only one that loves this one. I got this email, right? And then I spoke to, to Jen about it, Jen Gerard. She is such a sweetheart. I know she has a YouTube channel, but I know she hasn't posted in a long time, but that's okay. Ooh, that feels good. That is refreshing to the skin. I did not do my lips for a reason, like I said. I have a couple of things I have to do today. And one of them, the blood draws for my Hashimoto's um, diet change. <laughs> but it's it's one that, like, I'm like, I just, I like, I love that. The the heavy fruits, the heavy vegetables, um, natural, no sugars added, no salts added. Um, it's fabulous. I hear coffee is great for slowing it down. So thank goodness. Thank goodness for death wish. Thank you. Love you. Anyway, so I got this crazy email, right? So I asked Jen about it and she's like, huh? So she checked into it because I asked her some questions. And she checked into it. She's like, oh, God. That went out mistakenly. She didn't know. But <laughs> she's so wonderful to talk to. I sent her, like, screenshots of the actual text message. There's something in my sock. You ever hate that? Like, you put your socks on and you know there wasn't something on your sock when you put them on. And then there it. Like, what is that? I don't know. Anyway, I'll just change my socks. It's a sign. Anyway, so, um, how many times am I going to say anyway? <laughs> so, yeah, she is so wonderful to talk to. Um, yeah, I mean, like, there are several great people out there to talk to, right? That even though we may not agree on a lot of things, at least we don't push it down each other's throats. Thank God. Like, what's wrong with the world anymore? But it's Friday. Later, I will be on Freaky Friday. With, like I said, uh, Makeup Addict 1992, Alexandria is great to be on Freaky Friday with. We do have a topic, and you'll find out what that is later. But until then, stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, and as 
always stay blessed. This will be fun. And I will see you later tonight. And yeah, I'm going to do me some new nails.